Hey guys, Jeremy National Fire Radio, Turner River Fire Department, Stanford, Connecticut. I'm here again with Assistant Chief Bob Morris. A lot of you probably do recognize him. He's been around for a couple of years now in the fire service. Sure. Chief, thank you for joining me. Uh, we're doing a couple apparatus innovations, which is a lot of fun, and to, yep. to do it with you is just an absolute honor. So I appreciate your time. Talk to me about this. We're talking about uh, shuttle operations, uh, you know, tanker operations, mm -hmm. and so on here in the in the section of Stanford. Talk to me about this unique valve that we have in front of us, this appliance. So in a city of 130,000 people is where we are, you say, hey, we wouldn't really have to do this. But as it turns out, about one third of this city does not have a public water system. So with a department of this size, I just mentioned, it's, it's a relatively large department, both volunteer and paid. Uh, we have a lot of resources. So these tankers run on a regular box assignment to districts where there is no public water. When it comes time to fill these tankers up to do a tanker shuttle, we have a valve that we hook to a pumper that's hooked to a hydrant. We fill from hydrants. We usually don't draft, right? It's much more reliable for us to go, even if it's a mile or two, hook up to a hydrant, set up a fill site, and have a full engine company there to assist with getting these tankers filled sure. and get them out of there quick. So this, this would be supplied by a regular standard 1500 GPM engine hooked to a good hydrant, supply with a piece of five inch. These branches now would go to whatever tankers, say one would be here, one would be behind it. We would fill them one at a time, get one filled, get them on his way, get the next one. We could have them both hooked up, but we only fill one at a time, so we, right. don't, we don't take more time than we need. But we came up with this device, and this is a TFT five inch uh, gated Y that's right out of the catalog. Uh, and it has these slow closing valves because we had a water hammer problem. We had the water company was accusing us of breaking water mains because we had these <laughs> quarter turn big valves right. and they would slam shut sometimes because sure, we're filling in a thousand gallons a minute. So what we end up doing is they make this valve, we asked them for this valve, they made it. It's got a slow open and a slow close. Right. But what we added to it is we wanted a way of bleeding the line. So a piece of five inch or most of the time we actually use the three and a half. It doesn't have a lot of water in it. And it makes it a little difficult for the guys making and breaking the uh, the fill lines. What we did is TFT uh, had these collars. They made these collars for us, and we put these fittings on it. So once we shut down, so right now I'm shut down, and the guy wants to break the coupling, I just open up this ball valve, and now that takes the pressure off of it. Makes right. it a lot easier for that guy. To, even a few pounds of pressure on a store's fitting. Oh, I mean, absolutely. Pay, even with no pressure on, sometimes right. you fumble with them. So we, we, you know, TFT did this for us plus our own fire department shops did some modifications and we run this in a fill site box just like our dump site box this box is set up we got the box from uh, uh our polytech guys right ken, ken jackie up in uh cheshire and we just keep this as a, a setup so it stays together with some fittings right and the drivers know to take this out they have the fill hoses here they can set up a uh a relatively well it's almost like a, a nascar pit crew right in and out in and out in and out in and out and um you know that's that's one of the things we keep on this rig and both our tank we have a tanker here we have a tanker in long ridge and we have a second tanker in back uh they're all they all going to have these valves right so it's we try to standardize everything citywide i just i love the addition of these blow-offs if you will i i think of like airlines yeah. you want to bleed between two valves right you just bleed pressure. that you got to take the pressure off and that's exactly what this is and it's just so smart because you don't have to keep shutting down every time you're going yeah, to refill. Exactly. And I just, it's a, it's a really nice addition to this, uh, to this uh, Y. So beautiful job by the shops and by TFT. Yeah. And, uh, you know, Chief, thank you for sharing that with us. I appreciate it. Quite welcome. Guys, for Chief Morris and myself, Jeremy, National Fire Radio.